Hello everyone, I am Torbjorn, welcome back to Let's Play Cards of Iron 4S Germany. Uh, lesson pause, we are currently invading all of South America. With the, the, our armies that are way too big to be efficient, but still... It's just fun to have such a huge army everywhere. Even if it's suboptimal. Now, how's my nuclear research going? Because it is quite crucial. Let's speed this up, shall we? Oh, Venezuela gave up. Cool, gimme. That's it for Venezuela. Because they were not members of that alliance that happened. Okay, let's make sure to take the territory. You guys currently have no mission, do you? Well, some of you don't. Be specific, these three. I could use them as, you know, strike uh, groups, increasing strength and such. I think I'll just add them to the main army. Although they are gaining experience if they just fight like this, I could make use of them. Okay, let's make use of them. Just assign everyone to the front line, the same one. And give you all an order to go south. Execute. Where are you? Oh, right. It's a different, different region. Go, attack. Do things. Yeah. Supply is not perfect in the area. What I should really be doing is sending my tanks just along the coast and securing it for us. It does actually maybe possible. Didn't it? Am I sending a light tank battalion? Yes, I am. So as fast as it can be. Go, go, go. Take all the ports. Well, maybe not all of them because they're defending, but we did at least take one province. So I'll just let this happen. I'll just let it trickle down and we will, at some point, we will win this. In the meantime, I will develop my army so that we can beat our current allies. So we'll need a lot of ships. No, we don't need a lot of ships. We'll need a lot of good planes near Japan so we can drop some bombs in Tokyo. Uh, after we have taken the mainland bits of Japan, we will also be... Ooh, Fokkewolf, nice. Um, uh, why didn't we search jet engines? That's a mistake. After we've done that, we'll be, you know, invading the islands. And I have researched better fighters. Let's use those better fighters. Fighter 3. Considerably better. Is it, though? What's your range? No, it isn't. My fighter 2 is better than this fighter 3 in terms of range. And range is sometimes very important, so I'm going to keep producing upgraded fighter 2 as well. Why are you guys not attacking? Seriously. Should be way more aggressive. Yeah, just go. Don't worry about anything. Be super strong, super aggressive. Don't worry about <clears throat> not having full organization. Yeah, take all the coasts. That will make things much, much easier. If you can manage, of course. 
but they are underway, actually doing quite well. I could use some Panzer Divisions here. Who has some Panzer Divisions? I don't know, but these look promising. Yeah, go down here. Maybe we can make it work. Last order was not so good, but still. Oh, who gave up now? Peru. Cool. Gimme. That will extend the front lines a bit. Uh, actually, it broke my front lines. Crap. Okay, I need to redo your thing. Offensive line. Just go south. There's too much redoing. Yeah. The guys kept their orders, so it's gonna be fine. Well, at least some of them did. I need some tank battalions. Like this one. This one seems good. Go to the coast and continue along the coast, please. Go down south, through all of Chile. Oh, the invasion happened! I, I forgot about you, honestly. So you're this... no. Right, you're this guy's army. Going to cancel all your orders, do a normal front line, and move north. Yeah, did we? Oh, did we actually not take any ports? Crap. I need to build some ports then. Mm, here. And highest priority, of course. Oh, and that infrastructure is also quite important to me. Okay, continue. Stop your movement. Go here instead. If we know why, don't do that. Stay where you are. You move here. Recon Company. Um, let's keep upgrading that because I think I'm using it everywhere. Crap! Retreat! If you can hold out for long enough, I will build you ports. Please hold out. Crap! That was a mistake. I was sure that there was a port involved in this area. Let's cancel your orders. Hope you survive. There are no ports here, are there? Oh, crap. Going to lose these troops. That is a sad, sad day for the German Reich. I was certain there was a port here. Maybe I made a mistake. It is quite possible. Well, I will avenge them, I guess. Sorry, that was my mistake. No more national foci are necessary. Right, so when we attack Italy, station small armies around these areas. With Japan, it will be a little bit more complicated because we will need to do naval invasions. And also, there will be nuclear bombs. Lots of them. Okay, this is going well. The tanks are helping with manual orders of moving down south. So, how's that research? 77 days until I can start making nuclear bombs. 
Right. Yeah, I just um, need to drop them on the capitals of our future enemies. Ooh, free civilian factories. Seriously. I'm making like tons of nuclear reactors simultaneously. Let's get some more. Really need those bombs. I'm hoping that will be sufficient to keep you occupied. If I really need anything, I'll just move it to the top of the queue. Alright, this is finally looking better. A bit better. So which order is yours? This one, the big one. Yeah, when we annex all of them, I'm going to leave one small army here, 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 here. Small armies, middle-sized, no, yeah, one middle-sized army here and here. One bigger one here, one small here, one middle size here. Some, like, huge one here and here. And some naval invasions. Oh, and we finished research and I forgot. Um, what were we supposed to be doing? Rocket engines for jet planes. Right. You keep attacking. Where's that big order of yours? Did you forget your big order? You might have. I'll make another one just in case. Was anyone. No, nobody is assigned there. Okay. What I'm going to do is. Change the order a bit. Go this way instead. That should speed things up a bit, maybe. Okay, who gave up? Chile gave up. Yeah, of course I want everything, as I always do. Right. The order is still in effect. We don't need to change our priorities here. Oh, standard panzer. Yeah. Standard tank. The modern one. Don't need to research anything else with tanks now. Let's do logistics company. Also, production of tanks. I'm going to cancel all the medium tanks and replace them with the modern tanks which I'm going to make a variant of. Um, should I make you fast? Well, not all of them are medium tanks, I guess. No, this is not that important. Let's give you a lot of armor, reliability, some main gun power. E50A instead of the medium tank. Where is that one? E50A. E50A. Should probably replace all of them with medium tanks. With modern tanks. Mm, no, no. I can't just replace. I mean. I can't just make them replace light tanks with modern tanks, for example, when they run out of light tanks. Fortunately, it doesn't work like this. Don't need that many light tanks either. I do want a lot of these. I'm going to make modern tank divisions. Okay, you can keep producing. No templates. Yeah, we're going to be going to be fixing that soon. Come on, surrender everyone. It's already 1944, I need to finish the World Conquest. 
Move in. Attack. Just attack. Just attack. Go. Go for it. Maybe it'll work. Hmm, who knew? Super aggressive tactics actually work. When you are an overwhelming army like we are now. Okay, free military factories. Um, that would mean more. Thanks. Requires chromium. Go on, go on, attack. You go south towards the central bit here. You go there, you take Rosario. You guys go for this place. You go for here. You just go south. Oh, you already have your orders. Yeah, make them surrender fast. Take Sao Paulo. Nuclear bombs, finally. Thank you very much. Now we are unbeatable. Well, we already were, but still. Do I need excavation? Eh, not really. I'll do it anyway. No, I won't. I'll do support battalions. Oh, I could do paratroopers. Yeah. Probably won't use them, though. But I can do them. Argentina has capitulated, and we have finished Recon Company 3. Now I'm going to do... We don't need hospitals, because we have lots of manpower. I guess I'll do... This. Yeah, make sure everyone capitulates. All the good victory point provinces, we need to take them. Uh, right, Bolivia has given up. Not much left. Uh, who's still holding? Paraguay and Uruguay. Yeah, make sure you go to Uruguay. And Paraguay is under attack currently. Go, go, go! Come on! Almost done. Paraguay has capitulated. Now it's just Uruguay. And Uruguay is controlling... Oh, I just need to take a bit. They will surrender. Yay! That means the end of the war, doesn't it? Oh, there's still Brazil. Yeah, how could I forget you? Um, let's go towards Porto Alguer. More military factories. Um, give me more modern tanks. And um, that is E50A, please. Oh, and I need to make some bombers. Uh, strategic bomber two. Some more. Okay, that's fine. Brazil, would you like to give up now? Yes, you would. Yes, great news. Um, I'll pass a couple of times to accumulate enough points. Brazil, I cannot take all states. At least not through this interface. Paraguay. Okay, and now I need to manually click through Brazil. Okay. Is that all that you own? Yes, it is. Done. We have now annexed everyone who is not our ally. I am going to cancel all your orders 
stop you and I'm going to order you to do what exactly? Hmm. All right, you guys need to be added to this army as well. And you. Okay. Stop all of you, cancel all your orders. So, first of all, what I need to do is I need to mm, select all the guys that are expeditionary forces. Because they will betray us. Uh, can I deselect expeditionary forces somehow? Probably not. Yeah, it's going to be slightly tedious. Mm. I'll have to do it manually. Everyone who is in an expeditionary force needs to go into a different army. We're going to you we're going to do some subversion and say we're sending their troops to train in difficult terrain. And all of their troops will be far away when we decide to attack. Well an island, so oh no, not these guys. Oh crap, I did it the wrong way, didn't I? I had all of them selected. No, it was actually right. I started doing it right. Didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay, one more time. All the expedition effort. What was I saying? Oh, right. I'm going to... Tell them they're going to train on a remote island somewhere. Then I am going to send them there surround them with a fleet of my ships and then break the alliance. Hopefully they will not be able to return home to help their friends, although to be honest I think we would have defeated them regardless. They're going to the same remote island so they will suffer tons of attrition. No, not these guys. Yeah, just the expeditionary forces. There's quite a lot of them, isn't there? Hmm. I'm going to garrison an area with them. Okay, that's the Italians. Most of the forces are actually ours, so... It's not that many. Still, I need to make sure we don't run into any trouble because of these guys. So it is going to take me a little while to take care of that. Oh, cavalry. Seriously. Well, I guess they could still be useful in some terrain. Like, um... Let's think about it. Where would horse cavalry be more useful than tanks and jeeps and cars? Maybe in the jungle, but jungle is no place for cavalry anyway. Desert? Well, that would need to be camel cavalry, and there are uh, jeeps and cars and tanks able of operating in this sand, I guess. There's quite a ton of those troops. But we are nearing the end, I'm sure of it. I will unfortunately need to leave or dismantle the faction. I cannot just stay in an alliance with uh, one of them, beat the other, and then, you know, redo it. I need to check if I will be able to justify a war goal while in faction. Probably not. Oh, Japan seems to be the more dangerous enemy. They have quite a lot more troops than the Italians. Go on, go on. Yeah, I know it's taking forever, sorry about that, but this is the right way to do it. I am almost certain. We can't really use Italian expeditionary forces to fight Italy, can we? And if I ship them far enough. Oh, I could even surround them with my other troops. 
No, they would be exiled, I think. Oh, maybe not. Hmm. Tell me it's all of them. <laughs> Bloody hell. Just a bit more. So Japan was just producing troops and sending them to me. I just hope they weren't um, supplied from my from my manpower pool. Just a bit more. Maybe there is a button. Select all expeditionary forces or something. If there is, I will feel so very silly when I see it. Is it all of them? Tell me it's all of them. Yeah, it's all of them. 314 are in the newly created army. Where should I send them? Someone where there's no port. Like here. Yeah. And then station some troops around there. Yeah, I'm going to garrison the area with you. You'll go to Alaska, then I will move all of you to a single province, then I will block your way with some other troops of mine, and then I'll just, um, you know, move away. Let's see if they start moving. Yes, they do. It'll take them forever. Now, I need to make more forces, apparently. I should probably just deploy all these guys. Oh, right, I need to do modern tanks now. Let's edit this. Forget the motorized infantry. Just um, make this a modern tank battalion. Mm, also, maybe make it a bigger modern tank battalion. Uh, you don't need support, that's fine. Let's save it for now. I'll add some other support divisions later. Where's that modern tank bit? What? Oh crap, I forgot to... Crap, I forgot to duplicate. Now all our medium tank divisions are obsolete and useless. Feels so stupid right now. Okay, I need to redo it. I need to... Yeah, I need to... Cancel what we did. It will cost us military experience. I forgot to click duplicate. Let's save this. That's medium tank. Now I'm going to duplicate and now I'm going to replace it with modern tank. No, not medium. Modern. Yes, better. So we won't have just enough experience to do it. So where is the modern tank? Yeah, lots of these, please. Okay, lots of these guys have been deployed. They are not trained yet. Let me see my logistics. Okay, not enough modern tanks, but it is... Well, they are under construction. Okay, cool. So... Now, with the guys we have here... I guess I'll take 34 of you and split this in half. This army will be just send you over here. This army will be on this front line here. Okay, good. You have your orders. Do you? Yeah, you kind of do. Just yeah, tell you to garrison the area instead. Uh, you'll be blocking all the expeditionary forces from breaching a port. Can I demolish a port? Please tell me I can demolish a port. Nope. Still, it's far from any other ports. Their attrition should be high. Okay. Now, the rest of you. Who should I take on first? Probably Italy. 
we'll just move you over here and then we'll decide. It's going to take some time for you to move. Okay, also it is now time to end the episode. Thank you for watching, I hope you did enjoy the video and tune in next time for preparation preparations for the conquest of our allies. Thank you, see ya.